Hi there, everybody. How are you? Tracy slash Adora here with a card of the day. Um, I'm going to try and do these a little more often again. I thought, um, you know, especially for, you know, this, everybody's waiting for spring for the nicer weather. We're all stuck indoors. You know, everybody needs that little uplifting message. Okay, so... Oh, I got two of them. So I'm going to uh, start doing these a little more often. You're uh, going to see if your news feeds are open. Just give it a listen. They're all good positive affirmations. You know what? Um, I love them. My Wild Kwan Yin Oracle deck from Alana Fairchild. I love her deck. This one. Like, I got to get more of her because I love what she has to say. All right. So the first one. Ooh, look at that. Lovely artwork. Oasis of Hope. This. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, yeah. The successes that seem impossible are all the more precious for their unlikelihood. These are reminders of divine power, of the triumph of hope, of winning against the odds. Remember that life thrives, thrives, uh, hidden even in the desert. Do not give up hope. Believe in the in in inevitability. Inevitab Maybe I'm not the best one for these. In the inev inevitability of your beautiful destiny. Yeah, let's try. I gotta do some word word games or something there. Blah, 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 blah. Let me know. Let's try it again. Oasis of Hope. The, success, the, the successes that seem impossible are all the more precious for their unlikelihood. There are reminders of divine power, the triumph of hope, of winning against the odds. Remember that life thrives, hidden even in the desert. Do not give up hope. Believe in the inevitability of their beautiful destiny. Inevitability. Doesn't matter how many times I do it, it's going to come out the same way. I'm going to type it across there. You're going to see that. <laughs> but still, it's a beautiful card. It's more or less telling you, you know what, don't give up hope. Like, even the desert, you'll find water in some places. Don't give up hope. All right, the answer is there. You might have to look a little bit for it, but you will find the answer. All right, next one we have is good fortune granted. Like I said, don't know, don't stop looking. Just as there are physical seasons upon the earth, the soul too goes through its seasons. Spring in the soul heralds a time of birth. New ideas, new inspirations, new energy to take action, new life, new connections, and new gifts abound. New life and good fortune are headed your way. You know what? I just did a reading for a lady, and I hope she is listening to this because, um, you know what, this, this is a really good one for her as well. Uh, yeah, like, don't give up hope. The answers are where you least expect them. Okay? They really, really are. And like we said, with spring coming up about, you know what? look for things you're going to see it you're going to see those things that are going to make you happy and 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 they're going to make you motivated and want to get up and do things don't just sit there and watch tv you know get up and get motivated go out there's uh spring shows are starting to come out uh, easter is coming up for those that celebrate you know there's there's there's, there's so much there's so much look for it because if you close your eyes you're not going to see anything in life's just going to go all right so look for that hope look for the answers and you'll find it. Good fortune will be granted. All right. So there is your little positive affirmation for today. Don't give up hope. Don't ever give up hope. Look for those answers because you will find them if you look. All right. So this is Tracy signing off. You all have a great day. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Uh, give this video a thumbs up if you like to hear the positive messages I have to share. And um, yeah, share it. Share the video to those that you think might need this little message today. You know, if you got a friend that said, uh, you know, all hope is lost, I don't know what to do. You know, listen to this. You know, the universe is telling you that things are not as bad as they may seem at the moment, that there's always hope. You just got to look for it sometimes. All right, so you all have a great, great day. Bye, everybody. Hi there everybody, Tracy here from Adora's Ramblings, or Adora is another name I go for. I just wanted to share a little bit today on this uh, February 20th, 2020, a little, um, just a, a spiritual thing that I'm giving out. Um, I just want to share it with everybody. That's I just want to share it all with everybody and just give you a little show of what I do on certain days to help with the energy of, of me and those around me and just to help, um, you know, just to help. 
help whoever I can. Alrighty, this is just a little show. I'll give you a little uh, tour of what I've done and explain why I've done it. All right, so I'm just going to give you, uh, I can't flip it. Just hold on one sec. I'll be right back. Alrighty, so now we're back. Now, this is my altar. It is what it is. It's, uh, it's a work in progress, but this is uh, what I do and where I keep everything. So, yeah. So I just want to show you a little bit of what I've done for everybody today, just as a little bit of an outward blessing and a thank you and a little boost of luck and energy. I have, I'm burning two green candles that have been anointed with clove oil uh, for to give uh, prosperity and luck and abundance and finances and I'm sending that energy out to everybody okay and I'm burning frankincense in my little cauldron here to to give out uh, protection and and to make sure that no harm comes to everybody um, the same thing I'm burning uh, two white candles one is for a special uh, my group um, uh, that one there is to help them out. And then I've got another one here, the bigger one that is burning for, for everybody to, it's, it's give out that positive energy and that positive flow and a cleansing, a cleansing. That is the big thing. Cleansing, cleaning out the old and bringing in the new. And then I've got a red candle that I'm burning here to, to send out my love and, and hope that everybody gets it and everybody receives it and, and just feel it. Just sit down, close your eyes for a little bit and meditate and, and just, you'll feel my energy that is coming to you and then down here I have my little plate of uh, offerings that I'm going to uh, once all this is done I'm going to uh, coat in uh, peanut butter and sunflower seeds and then I put them outside and that's my my offering to nature and and giving back as a thank you for uh, for everything that uh, that has come my way whether big or small so yeah so this is what I have done for everybody. And I hope, I really hope you feel it. Uh, don't be afraid about the skull. It's just a Halloween decor. And you know what? I kind of like it. Um, so I drew these little, uh, my own little um, sigils on it with my pentagram in the back. And yeah, yeah, it's more or less um, a, a prop that I use, but I like it. It makes the look. <laughs> So hi, I'm back. So yeah, I hope everybody just takes a minute to sit down, relax, you know, take a minute for yourself. There's a lot of energy coming through today on this day. You know, like 02, 20, 20, 20. You know, there's... It's, there's a lot, a lot going on today, and I'm just trying to send out a little bit of extra oomph for everybody so that, uh, you know, they can just get through this, this, this time of year. The spring is coming. It's coming. The groundhog seen his shadow, apparently, or didn't see his shadow. Or whatever. All I know is he said there's only six more weeks of winter. We'll see what happens. All right. So everybody enjoy your life. Enjoy yourself. Be happy. Smile. Laugh. Share it. Spread it. You know, emit positivity. I know. I know it can get boring being said positivity. I'm sick of it. You know what? But after a while, it's just going to become natural. And, and you won't have to be reminded and, you know, you won't have to feel like, oh, am I doing it? Or, you know, you're going to start sharing it and you're going to start spreading it yourself. You know what? That, that little bit of kindness can go a long way. If somebody's being mean to you or something, or, you know, say somebody banged into you in the grocery store and didn't say sorry. You know what? Don't make a snarky remark. Be the bigger person and just walk on. Like, you know what? It's, it's why waste the energy and the time. So, yeah, okay, that's just my little message today for our February 20th, 2020. Um, I hope you can feel all this energy that I am sending out. I am trying my best. I just feel like I'm just one. I am so warm right now. Like the heat is just radiating out of me. And I hope I'm spreading it out to all of you. So you all have a great, great day. And I will see you all next time. Bye.